Imagine an organization that brings Jewish women from all over the world for a free eight-day trip to engage with one another and get to know each other and Israel from within. Well, the Jewish Women's Renaissance Project does exactly that, and Lori Palatnik, the founding director of this trip, is here to tell us all about it. Lori, thank you so much for coming in. Pleasure, Aaron. Thank it's you. It's pleasure's all mine. So tell me a little bit about this trip. Tell me about uh, you know the Jewish Women's Renaissance Project. Well, it started uh, almost 10 years ago with eight women in the D.C. area who decided to do something very big to impact the Jewish world by unlocking the power of Jewish women. And so you did that by opening up kind of like a, a call to all Jewish women in the diaspora to come to Israel and, and meet you? So what we did was we did it in partnership with existing organizations. We now mm. have 220 partner organizations in 26 countries. Wow. And we do it in now in partnership with the Ministry of Diaspora Affairs. And we brought almost 16,000 women uh, from all over the world to have this really a, a transformational experience in Israel. And they go back with their partner organizations for a one year follow up. That's incredible. And, so, and how long have you been doing this project? So this is our ninth year of trips. We established ourselves 10 years ago. And t right now, like tomorrow, 200 of their husbands are landing. And the next week, 200 more of their husbands. Because they insisted that their, their men also have to have this experience. They have to. So, so they, want, they want to share in, in the joy and kind of the experience. Well, they, they want their, their husbands to understand what they've experienced mm -hmm. and to get on the same page in terms of connecting to Jewish values, engaging with Israel, taking action and responsibility mm -hmm. in their own communities, and creating unity without uniformity. We're creating this incredible uh, sort of groundswell uh, like of, of people who, beyond politics or organizations, sure. that were connecting Israel and the diaspora. Because we bring Israeli women, mothers, also on every trip. And so, and then these relationships kind of go back home with these people. I mean, have you seen, have you seen the future after these people have returned home? And what does that look like? So it's really a game changer. So for most of these people, over half of them, these are like they have to have children under the age of eighteen at home. Mm -hmm. So for half of these mothers, the last time they were here, they were they were fifteen or sixteen, and they are strong as memory was. The soldiers are so cute, and I tell them the soldiers are still cute, but now they're your son's age. And the other half have never been to Israel. So the mother, you have to appreciate that the, the eight women who started this, mm -hmm. we didn't start a women's movement because we're a bunch of girls. Sure. We started because it's strategically smart, because the mother is the greatest influencer of the home. Influence the influencer, mm -hmm. and the ROI, the return on your investment, is even greater. All right, so how do people get involved in the Jewish uh, Women's Renaissance well, Project? All they how have do they to do volunteer? How do they get into the trip? <laughs> yeah, so it's a free trip, not including airfare. Okay. And all they have to do is go to jwrp.org. Uh, jwrp.org and they can see that there are many trips that are offered uh, you have to go in your city with your city group the power of it is that they're coming from the same community having this profound mm. transformational experience and going back to the same community so the follow-up is much easier and they create this again this power they this have is this kind of community that they take back with them as well right so you have many microcosm. communities but they're all connected to the organization and we're, cre we're creating a movement well, that's incredible. Lori, thank you so much for coming in and sharing this. A pleasure. This, this, this is amazing. And uh, if I didn't already live here, I'd take you up on the offer. <laughs> well, send um, your mom. So I'll, I will. <laughs> thank you so much. Pleasure.